everybody. <laughs> Maybe I was being delusional. Like, <laughs> this is deformation of character. It was like, if my mom sees this. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to my digital diary. Today we have a story time coming up. My first ever story time. Some of you might be like, you have said a story time before on here. However, that story time I forgot to tell you guys that you have to decide whether it's a true story or not. If you don't know what I'm talking about, you can go and check out my hiking vlog whereby I tell a story time right at the beginning of the video. Okay, 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 so our tea time is going to be featuring some chocolate because it's so bitter So need to add some sweetness to it mm. <laughs> Okay, okay, okay So as I said the story time is bitter Therefore, you need some chocolates. Um, I have wedge wood right here. This is not a sponsored YouTube, by the way. It was established in 1999. Guess who else was established in 1999? Anyways, child, so. One thing about me when I start reading books, I wanted to capture my attention, like the first three pages, even five pages, like capture me, like let me be in your world type of vibes. And so many books don't do it for me. So I end up starting a book and not finishing it because of that reason. Um I wanna start this one all over again because I wanna understand what it's talking about and yeah so this is my read guys let me know what you're reading my two people that are always watching my videos i'm joking i'm joking i'm joking <laughs> let me know what you're reading this is what i'm reading i'm reading why your best is good enough by dr kevin lemon or the man Okay guys, so the story time is about Instagram, right? What happened was that, guys, 2020, 2021, like, I, I was having my glow up, you know? Um, Instagram influencer vibes, like, aspiring Instagram influencer vibes, like, my following was growing, my Instagram was, like, booming and stuff like that, and I was a happy baby, like, during that time, it was the same time when um like the family um instagram also began like everything was going well right and then one day i just received a dm from one of my male followers and was like um there's this account which followed me with your name it has a dp and everything and it has your pictures i just wanted to make you aware of it because it doesn't seem like it's you maybe somebody is forging your account so i was like um okay cool you know thank you i didn't take it um that seriously you know and then next thing i'm like now nah, let me go check this account out Anyways, how so? I was like, oh, you know, maybe it's one of those people that you know. Maybe I was being delusional because <laughs> I was like, maybe it's a fan account, you know. Maybe somebody decided, oh, I like her pictures. Let me just, you know, start an account where I, I can, like, you know, take her pictures and repost them. And I was, I was gonna be cool with that, you know. So I went to check, and I was kind of happy. <laughs> like <laughs> now that i think about it like i'm laughing i was like no this is actually cute but then i go and i check the account and it's not what i thought and the first thing that came in my mind was like if my mom sees this i am like gone 
Yo! Kanti, it was one of those, you know, um, fake profiles whereby they take your pictures and um, use them for their own game, you know, like um, make it seem as if you're the one with the OnlyFans, OnlyFans account. I reported this account to Instagram. Instagram did not. Instagram was like, there's not enough proof to prove that this person is on Instagram illegally. So my brother, my little brother did some digging and they found that this person was... Yo, I even forgot that country guys, but like I have screenshots of everything from that time. This gets to show you that my YouTube channel was supposed to start a long time ago because that was supposed to be one of the story times I was going to tell on my YouTube channel. So my brother tracked it down and he was able to do something about it. I don't remember what, but like... I think block the link or something that they were trying to use um, only fans or what I was really sad because I was like this person is this is defamation of character this is not me it didn't reflect me like my content what I wanted it to be about was like confidence being comfortable in your own skin and stuff like that because all these things stem up from past experiences which I'm going to share with you guys for example being bullied just because you are dark skin in school so when I went to when I joined Instagram it was more of I want to change this um, I want young girls to know that they're beautiful in their own skin and stuff like that so seeing somebody taking my images and using them for such was really hungry ever since that time my content hasn't been the same um, flows of rain I was like on 3k and after that incident I stopped posting as consistently as I used to um, my followers went down I was, now I'm like on 2.5 because I understand what are you following me for I barely do anything so my followers just went shiku, kuku, 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 kuku. and one thing I learned is that you know downfalls come in different ways I might not know this person but it's like this person planned out my downfall or whatever and I learned from that I learned that sometimes these things happen to teach you a lesson it's like a blessing in disguise whereby how would you deal with the situation how would you deal with the devil trying to test you um, trying to bring you down and so on um, during that time I folded but it will never happen again because I know that I was heading in a great direction and I should continue what doesn't kill you only makes you stronger um, I hope that that person gets help because that's a sick who does that I've learned that some people are not happy in their lives so they try to bring um, that sort of dark cloud upon your life and as I said guys I have so many story times um, that have built me to being the kind of person I am today and you know sometimes things either break you make you a bad person or build you up to being a better person like better than the situation that you were in better than the person that made you go into that situation you know so those are the kind of stories i want to share and i want people to feel inspired and feel like they can come out of any situation just like i did i mean i get it sitting deep share that's why you stole my pictures but please next time don't use them for such my instagram was made to like you know give confidence to girls like myself girls who are told they are not beautiful girls who are made to feel less of themselves um, girls who follow christ and Girls who just wanna be, you know, yeah, and not live up to anybody's expectations, but your own. Uh, I owe myself so many apologies, but that's a topic for another day. And also, I learned that people who do this kind of things are people who are not happy with themselves, are people who are not content with themselves. So they would obviously go out of their way to hurt somebody else. We've seen catfish. We've seen so many people's identities being stolen just to be used for ridiculous things so 
I knew I was in the first, but um, when you do shoes, it's not nice. It doesn't feel cute at all. For me, it felt like my world was crumbling down. Some people weren't really helpful. They'll just come like watch your story and be like, guys, help to report this account. They're just enjoying the drama. Like this one guy from high school, he was like, oh, Sarah, so this is now what you do, what, what, making it a joke. And at that time, I wasn't laughing because it wasn't funny. What you can do is help. Like, and another thing is like, oh, this this whole time, you never care to say hi, never care to say anything, but you see such a horrible situation, and then you come and make jokes about it. Like, some things never change in this life. Oh, and guys, some people are so helpful and so so sweet. Like, they showed up for me, and it was so cute, man. Thank you to everybody that showed up for me and that is watching this right now. Thank you. I think about my siblings, they're so supportive. They're like, do this, do that, do this, do that, do this. I was just like, guys, guys, this, guys, that. And <laughs> oh my, I feel like it's one of like the worst things that have ever happened during that time. So that was my story time guys, it was really bitter and it might not sound like it was bitter, some of you might be like, it's not a big deal, but it was to me because that's not who I am, that's not what I represent. Yeah. So if you want to follow me on Instagram, I'll put up my handle, I'm working on the kind of content that I want to upload on there um, and time will tell how everything goes and I've been moving like but it feels nice moving around telling your story time you move like this you move like that create a pair of guys let me do a quick photo shoot for you photo shoot pose 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 anyways ciao um let me know if you guys want more story times even if you don't want more story times i'm gonna give you story times anyways and also um i'm going to try and incorporate everything that i have in my youtube banner fashion beauty uh, already i'm doing diary i'm doing vlogs so i want to incorporate everything else that i said i was gonna put in my um youtube so expect that i keep on saying this but i am working on it guys i'm working on it i'm working on being more consistent like posting at least twice in a week so that is also going to be a thing and i'm excited to see where this goes please don't forget to like subscribe and comment turn on those post notifications until next time bye